our target is just above 7 million. So far we've only had 2.9 million that have vaccinated and that is a serious worry because we have been around that number for more than four months now and that is why we have decided that we needed a a program that actually goes to communities and get them to come and vaccinate. I must also indicate though that in that 2.9 million people who have vaccinated, it's mostly those that are insured. Those that live in rural areas and townships are the ones who are not coming out to vaccinate and that is why we decided to have a program that specifically targets them. The district of Ofutugela is our lowest district when it comes to vaccinating and we've only had about 100 or just above 198,000 uh, people that have vaccinated and that is a serious worry. That is 198,000 on a total of 500,000 people that have actually registered. Now the fact that is an indication that there is a serious worry. That is why with this program we decided to come here in a place called Eightfall because they are one of those that are the lowest when it comes to vaccinating. We have found that there's quite a number of myths and misconceptions that are making the rounds and the majority of them are coming from the social media platforms. Um, some of them are indicating that there are quite a few people who have passed on or they believe that there's quite a few people who have passed on from the vaccination. Others believe that when you get vaccinated you are not going to have kids, but that's with the younger generation. Others believe that particularly the males that if you get vaccinated, you then become important. So, you know, we, we, we have had to deal with all these misconceptions and we believe that coming here, walking around the community or walking amongst the communities, we are able to dispel the myths that are there. We have been able to actually do that. The people that have been coming up or have come out to our pop-up sites as we are going around have actually promised a, a promise that they will vaccinate and the numbers are quite promising. It's a clear indication that all, the only thing that people need is someone to speak to them properly and explain properly what is a vaccine and how it works. We certainly believe that our approach should be different from how we had been engaging with our communities in the past year or so. Previously, we were just sending messages over the radio, we we're just sending messages on TV, but we think that we are now going to start engaging communities directly ourselves. We will be engaging communities directly as the provincial government led by the Premier and um, all the other MECs that are, going, that are champions in the different districts and they'll be visiting their different districts. But we will be engaging communities through the different sectors. We'll be engaging on Namakosi, we'll be engaging with the religious sector, we'll be engaging with traditional health practitioners and the business people. So we, are now, we have now decided that we will be going directly to communities so that we give communities an opportunity to ask us questions that are worrying them, to ask us questions that they are uncomfortable with and they are able to go and vaccinate. And during those programs, we will be having pop-up sites in each and every one of those programs that are going to be conducted throughout the province.